night, it was announced that as a $38 million alternative to avoid an even more expensive expansion of Grand Rapids wastewater treatment facility. But the price tag on the city's biodigester currently under construction could take a big leap from $38 million to over $57 million. So why the increase and who will pay for it? 24-Hour News 8's Joe LaFergie sat down with city officials to get some answers. Very active construction site here behind the city's wastewater treatment plant. Right now, the biodigester project is about 45% complete. And could end up costing nearly $20 million over the original $38 million cost estimates. Last October, city commissioners approved a revised budget for the biodigester not to exceed $57 million and some change. City officials blame an increase in heavy equipment and fabrication costs, something Grand Rapids Managing Director for Public Service Tom Almonte says is hitting everyone. Uh, we're seeing increases between 10, 15, 20, 30, up to 40 percent increases from projection to what the projects are because the market is shifting. What's driving the biodigester project is growth, especially the number of businesses setting up shop in Grand Rapids. Production, especially at food-related businesses, creates a lot of waste, and the current wastewater treatment plant is nearing capacity. One option was limiting waste discharge permits. Translation, uh, we had to say to the business community, you cannot grow anymore in our community. And we knew that we couldn't have that conversation. The biodigester is an alternative designed to take wastewater from large producers like Founders Brewery, pipe it into large tanks now under construction. That's the first one. And basically cook it down to much smaller, more manageable solids. A byproduct of the process, natural gas will then be sold back to energy suppliers. But the biggest benefit will be in reduced waste going into the city's current system. Without the biodigester alternative, the city was looking at doubling the current treatment plant capacity at an estimated cost of $148 million. The bill for the biodigester and related projects is paid through the city's sewer fund, part of your quarterly sewer bill. Initially, the project may increase sewer bills by less than half a percent, but eventually, city officials say the sale of natural gas and reduction in waste sent to the current treatment plant will result in savings. We see that the biodigestion will reduce um, mitigate the increase of rate by 9% to our community. And if you'd like to learn more on how this biodigester will work, we have a link at woodtv.com. In Grand Rapids, Joe LaFergie, 24 Hour News 8.